Hello everyone, I welcome you to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to install Angular on a Windows operating system. So let's begin. Now to install Angular, you will need basically Node.js. So for that, let's go to our you know browser and download our Node.js. So just simply type Node.js download, and it will going to redirect you to this you know Node.js.org. So just simply click on that. And here you can see this is our official site of Node.js and see our Node.js is available for Windows, Mac OS and uh, source code is also available. Now this is you know the LTS version which is long term version and this is the current version. So I am going to download the current version which is you know version 18.8.0. So just simply click on um, that version and see our download has rightly began. So I will just simply minimize my browser. I will go to my download directory and see our node.js is already downloaded over here just simply double click on it to install our node.js let's minimize our download directory and here just simply click on next just accept the license agreement just simply click on next this is our you know base installation folder just simply keep this default just simply click on next and uh, these are all you know node.js then code pack all files uh, they're going to you know install just keep this default simply click on next and uh, you can again simply click on next over here and see it ready to be installed just simply click on install and it uh, it will ask you for administrative privileges just simply click on yes and our installation has rightly began and now as you can see that our node.js is slightly installed it will take maximum two to three minutes okay so after you know node.js is rightly installed just simply click on finish and now uh, let's check whether node.js is properly installed or not just simply type cmd and just open this command prompt and here just simply type node space dash dash version and enter and you can see that latest version of node which is version 18.8.0 is rightly installed so now that you know that our node is rightly installed it's you know time to install our angular okay so before installing angular i'd also like to tell you that it's uh, like quite important to install visual studio code as well if you are using some other you know code editor which is totally fine like you can use sublime or you know brackets or any other you know id also you can use that is totally your wish i'm I, i'll be using uh, visual studio in this code so i'll be recommending you to install one id as well okay so you know code editor is also there and node.js is also installed so time to install our angular just simply type cmd again once again and i'll open our command prompt so i'll be installing angular using the cli method so here you need to just simply type npm install then space dash g which is global at the rate angular slash cli then hit enter and see it has rightly started installing our angular so you will need you know internet uh, right throughout this installation so what they're going to do is they're going to you know fetch all you know files and folders from you know internet so you need to have an active internet connection and this installing angular will you know take some time uh, about uh, three to four minutes i would say so you know i'll be coming back right after finishing up this process yeah so welcome back and now you can clearly see that our angular is rightly installed so you can always test whether your angular is installed properly or not so for that just simply type ng space v then enter and see it has rightly shown angular C cli and here you can see that our angular cli version 14.2.1 is rightly installed okay and our node version is also you know uh, that is 18.8.0 so our angular and our node all are you know installed properly so it's time to you know create a simple angular project and i'm going to also show you how to run them so for that let's you know close this you know command prompt i'll be simply creating a new folder and giving the name as angular dash practice okay i'll just simply go inside that folder and uh, and i'll be you know going to open our command prompt right in this directory so i'll just simply type cmd over here and our command prompt is rightly open right in uh, in this uh, you know angular practice directory so now i'll be simply going to create a new you know project so for that just simply type new sorry ng new 
and then you need to give your project name so let's give your project name as my first angular project right and just simply hit enter and it will going to start you know creating our first project again uh, you need to have active internet uh, you know connection right throughout this installation uh, but before that it is asking whether you'd like to you know uh, create angular routing this is a simple project so i'll not need any routing and all i'll just simply you know hit n and enter and it's asking you know the what type of you know uh, uh, style should you you'd like to use which is css or you know acss or sas or less uh, I, i'll be using simple you know css over here so i'll switch back to css and then hit enter and see it has rightly started creating our project okay so this will again you know take some time uh, a couple of minutes maybe so i'll be coming back right after finishing up this process yeah so we'll come back and now you can clearly see that our project is successfully installed so you know our package installed successfully so this and you can see that my first angular project is rightly created over here so let's navigate to that folder and i'll be again simply you know typing cmd over here i'll just simply hit enter so that our command prompt rightly open on this directory and then i'll be simply typing ng serve and hit enter So what it will do is it will you know going to start compiling our project and then they are going to create a local server. So on that server our project is going to you know start running. So you know give some time to you know to compile our project. And now as you can see that you know it is you know compiled successfully. So you know in our browser on this you know URL to see you know uh, project. So I'll be just simply going to copy this and i'll be to my browser i'll open a new tab and i'll just simply paste it and i'll just simply hit enter and see our you know my first angular project app is up and running so in this way you can easily install the latest version of you know angular on a windows operating system so if we go back to you know our project so see it has you know all files and folders rightly over here so let's open uh, this project in our visual studio code so i'll be just simply you know closing this i'll be again opening our command prompt on this directory and if i type code and dot and hit enter you can see that our project is rightly open in our visual studio code i'll just you know, simply check this and see our our uh, our first project is rightly opened over here so if i go back to angular uh, sorry package.json and scroll down you can see this angular cli version 14.2.1 is rightly installed on our machine so in this we can easily install the latest version of angular on windows operating system so that's basically all about this video thank you very much for watching this video and god bless you all